Arts, I served two years on the Percival Town Council. I also served three years on the Loudoun County Community Services Board in support of MR, MH, and SA services for the county. Additionally, I've um, worked in the public school system both at a school base level and in their central office managing federal grants. And then um, my private sector corporate experience, I worked 15 years um, in the technology sector selling data services to the federal government. I don't think that my story is that remarkable compared to others. I've met so many people over the years that had it much worse than I did. But my parents did divorce when I was um, nine years old. And, uh, and I didn't see my father for 10 years. So my mother was a, a suddenly a single mother of three children and we had to move every year, every year the, the rent went up. I grew up in Northern Virginia, I went to 11 different schools and that wasn't because I was a military brat, it was because uh, we were living on welfare and we had to move every year, the rent went up. So at a young age I started working, my two brothers did as well to help support my mother and um, the typical started out babysitting, then at 14 got a job in a restaurant and worked in restaurants from there out until I landed a locksmith apprentice job, worked at that, drove a school bus in 1983 for a private school and uh, then I landed in the technology sector in 1984. I was very fortunate, very blessed. I had a neighbor at the time who said, Janet, you're much better than this. Uh, why don't you come interview for this job? It took me three interviews. I had to borrow a dress and, and some heels and go in, interview three times to convince them. I was just, um, I was a high school graduate with a GED. And I, I dropped out of school at 16 because I was working so much and went and, and got my GED. Still graduated on time by taking the test with an 11th grade education. Got the job working 11 p.m. to 7 a.m., $15,000 a year. I'd work overtime 7 p.m. to 7 a.m. to make extra money. So uh, first year that I worked, I think I made about $20,000. I was just ecstatic. And um, then within a year, I moved into sales and between 1984 and, and 1990, I had uh, worked up to a six-figure income. And MCI Government Systems recruited me, and I uh, continued on being a successful sales rep for them and being in the top 5%. And uh, I had three children by 98. I was traveling about 70% of the time. It was too much of an impact on my family. I was uh, also volunteering the community as I always have. Started an English as a Second Language program uh, in Western Fairfax where we were living at the time and um, was chair of church and society doing a lot of programs. I was too stretched and so uh, my husband and I uh, decided that the best thing would be to leave the industry and um, pursue other avenues to be with the family more. We moved out to Loudoun County now, 13 years ago, it's the best decision I ever made. And uh, we just adjusted our lifestyle. We, we bought down and uh, moved to a great area. And I love my county and I love the people that I encounter every day. And so I want to serve at this next level to serve the people.